for nothing. Or die. For something. Fans of Rambo have reason to rejoice, as it appears that Sylvester Stallone's iconic character, John Rambo, may continue his adventures, despite previous indications that his story has concluded. Even though Stallone had previously stated that Rambo Last Blood marked the end of John Rambo's story, there are persistent rumors suggesting the potential for a Rambo 6, which has excited fans. Stallone has a history of reviving beloved characters like Rocky Balboa and Barney Ross from The Expendables, leading fans to believe that another Rambo installment might indeed happen. A fan-made concept trailer titled Rambo 6 New Blood has further intensified speculation and enthusiasm among fans for the continuation of the Rambo franchise. Yes, guys, a fan-created trailer for a hypothetical movie titled Rambo 6 New Blood has gained significant attention online, providing viewers with a glimpse of what could be the next chapter in John Rambo's story. The trailer was produced by the YouTube channel KH Studio, known for creating fan-made trailers. It features a 79-second teaser that incorporates scenes from Sylvester Stallone's previous films, such as The Expendables and the Rambo franchise. In this concept trailer, Stallone reprises his role as the war veteran John Rambo, who is depicted facing off against John Bernthal, known for his roles in Marvel projects. The teaser includes footage of Bernthal digitally altered to portray a potential villain in the movie. Interestingly, the trailer also claims that Rambo 6 New Blood is set to be released in 2024, adding to the excitement and speculation surrounding the possibility of a new Rambo installment. This trailer not only showcases thrilling action sequences, but also hints at a more profound exploration of the core themes that have defined the Rambo series over the years. The trailer begins with Sylvester Stallone delivering a poignant line, I will keep fighting, nothing will stop me which reflects Rambo's enduring spirit and determination. But guys, the main question is, is Sylvester Stallone planning Rambo's sixth installment? In the past, Deadline reported that the production company New Image had partnered with Entertainment One to work on a television show inspired by the Rambo franchise. However, there haven't been any significant updates on the progress of this project recently. Even though Sylvester Stallone may not want to play the character of Rambo again, he suggested to The Hollywood Reporter that a new installment in the series could be in development. In his interview, the 77-year-old actor hinted that a different actor might take on the role of Rambo and teased details about the potential storyline for the new film. The actor said, I think it's going to happen. I wanted to do it like a Ken Burns documentary on Vietnam, where you drop young Rambo in there and he's this outgoing guy, football captain, and then you see why he becomes Rambo. But what they want to do is a modern-day story where I pass the torch. That's getting close. Stallone may have concluded his portrayal of Rocky Balboa, another iconic character of his. He notably opted out of appearing in Creed III, the third installment of the Creed series, where he played Rocky in the first two films. Despite rumors of a Rocky prequel series in development at Amazon Studios with Stallone's participation, it remains uncertain if he would make any on-screen appearances as the older version of Rocky in this project. It's pretty close, Stallone said, of the Rocky prequel series happening in a THR interview, admittedly questioning if it would even work. There's a side of me that goes, is this really going to work? Every time you try to do Son of Kong, Son of Tarzan, it doesn't work. There's a certain indescribable formula that happens. If I gave you the novel The Godfather, good luck on casting that today. Good luck selling that whole premise today. On the other hand, DCEU actors might return to the DCU in different roles, and it would be ideal for Sylvester Stallone to take on a Golden Age boxer turned superhero. The upcoming DC Universe reboot, starting with Superman Legacy, has many details still uncertain, particularly regarding which DC heroes and villains will be part of the established universe. Recent casting announcements for the movie have shed some light on this, but leave room for additional characters including ones from the Golden Age of Comics. James Gunn, the creative lead of DC Studios and director of Superman Legacy, has mentioned on social media that actors who have previously voiced DC characters can still take on live-action roles as different characters in the DC Universe. One example is Sylvester Stallone, who voiced King Shark in The Suicide Squad. 
This means Stallone could potentially portray a live-action character in the DC Universe, perhaps a boxer with a legacy even longer than his iconic role as Rocky. Gunn's openness to allowing actors who voiced DC characters in animated projects to take on new live-action roles creates an exciting opportunity for veteran actor Stallone. Stallone has a history of working with Gunn, having appeared in Gunn's Marvel Studios film Guardians of the Galaxy Vol. 2 and voiced King Shark in The Suicide Squad. King Shark, a replacement for Killer Croc in The Suicide Squad, is a massive, powerful, and violent character who doesn't speak much. Stallone's portrayal of King Shark might not have been immediately recognizable to audiences unfamiliar with the cast, as the character mainly focused on physical actions rather than dialogue. As there are no immediate plans for a third Suicide Squad film, it's uncertain if King Shark will appear again in the DC Universe. This uncertainty means Stallone is available to join the new shared universe, potentially in a role similar to his iconic portrayal of a boxer, given his history with playing such characters. As all of you know, Stallone is widely regarded for his roles as John Rambo and Rocky Balboa in action-packed movies. While the Rocky series and its Creed spin-offs seem to have concluded, Stallone could still join the DC Universe as a new character. Ted Grant, also known as Wildcat. Wildcat is a superhero from the golden age of comics and is often depicted as an early member of the Justice Society of America. Despite retiring from boxing and active heroics, Wildcat remains an integral part of the superhero community. He is known for training iconic heroes such as Black Canary, Catwoman, and even Batman. This transition would allow Stallone to bring his experience as a boxer from his portrayal of Rocky into the superhero realm, embodying a character with a rich history and connections within the DC Universe. Given that Hawkgirl and Mr. Terrific are already confirmed members of the Justice Society in the upcoming DCU reboot, it would make sense for Wildcat to be included as well. The premise of Superman Legacy revolves around a generation of heroes predating Superman, making Wildcat a fitting addition. This decision not only reunites Sylvester Stallone with director James Gunn, who has a penchant for working with familiar actors like Nathan Fillion, but also offers a meta casting opportunity. Well, that's it for today. As we wrap up our video on the potential return of Sylvester Stallone to iconic roles like John Rambo and the exciting possibilities of him joining the DC Universe as Wildcat, one question lingers. Which character portrayal are you most looking forward to seeing Stallone tackle next? The hardened war veteran Rambo or the seasoned superhero Wildcat? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Hit like if you're eager for more Rambo and don't forget to subscribe for all the latest updates. Until next time, keep the action going.